Hi folks, it's Sarah with Sarah Be Happy Plans and I am going to give you a flip through of my 2022 big vertical happy planner. Um, I started last year with a mini planner and it was my first ever planner and um, I quickly realized the mini was not big enough for me. So I switched to a happy planner and um, I didn't start this till February. So there's nothing for January and we're gonna skip right to Feb. Um, this is my first ever currently page. Not proud of it, but that's what it is. February, my first big monthly. And I had gotten some stickers from, I think Hobby Lobby, some little Valentine stickers. I loved this spread. It's very busy. Um, once I wrote in it, but these were squad girls. Loved this one. This was the bookish stickers. Um, Valentine's week. Wasn't crazy about this. My lettering was not good. Um, loved this one. I think I used uh, happy illustrations for this. And then my March currently, which is from, these stickers were from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop on Etsy. And the Pretty Spring March. I loved this. This was my birthday week spread. Um, and I loved how it turned out. These pastels are my jam. I love the pretty bright colors. My birthday's March 6th, so. Um, this was Live, Love, Posh, Wanderlust, I think. St. Patrick's Day spread. This I used um, Miss Maker. Oops. This, um, as you can see, I cut, I punched it wrong. So this just always flies out, but I used the Cinderella. Um, from the Disney Princess sticker book, and then some pretty Daisy Wushy on this, um, whatever that's called. And then I had my April currently. I have a million birthdays in April. This was another Live Love Posh Wanderlust. I believe these are with some Wushy tape. Uh, this was all. Oh, this, these were, this is wishy and these are wishy. And then this, I believe is, um, our stickers from Amber Plans Her Day. This one was so pretty. This again was, pretty sure it's the Live Love Posh book. Um, my son's birthday cute I love this spread too because it's so bright this was um, retro happy planner stickers uh, I can't remember the name blue and white and black and then April May currently and these are stickers I believe from live love posh this is a live love posh stickers in here for my May monthly. This is, um, gosh, mixed media mom, I believe. And then as you can see, I didn't decorate this page. Um, it's another squad girls book. Uh, Little Mermaid from the Disney Princess. And then this pretty um, currently page for June. And I did Rainbow for Pride Month. <clears throat> um, and these are from uh, Planny Thing, her rainbow sticker book. And then I think these are from the Happy Planner. Um, this might be Kell of a Plan stickers here. And then um, the rainbow design happy planner book or some of these. I used a few different ones for this page, but I like how that turned out. 
Um, some Jungle Book for the June monthly. Another June monthly. Um, these were planning thing, houses and trees, and some grid washi. Um, <clears throat> June, Squad Girls. And I love this spread. This was um, for Pride. Um, yeah, and I used, um, I think this was Live Love Posh. Um, from her rainbow pack. I was going through a hard time here. I remember with some personal stuff going on in my life. These were, um, I don't remember where these were. Maybe another from um, one of the Live Love Posh rainbow sticker books. It's fun, summer spread. Um, another more squad girls and uh, some of these like this was she is from um, an Archer and Olive sub box. And then I just did a page of mostly <laughs> stickers for my July monthly with the um, Miss Maker. July monthly, pretty chill squad girls. More um, fun, happy, vibrant July colors. This one I liked because um, I used some scrapbook paper for the corners and this was the weekend of me and my girlfriends. Um, our girls trip we take every year. And unfortunately, as you'll see, I came back with COVID, which was a bummer. So I was home this whole week. And um, I ended up back planning this week and doing um, most of this, like, once I started feeling better on Friday. Um, and then July, these were Live Love Posh. And then I started a mood tracker for my August monthly, these stickers. I love these with the blue background from, um, a happy planner sticker book. I thought this was really pretty. This was from the Green Blooms Live Love Posh sticker book for August. And then I used the uh, Stick Babe and these flowers were probably, who knows. Um, sorry, I am not good at remembering, but they were either from probably an Amber Plants Her Day or a Live Love Posh sticker book and this one I didn't do a lot of writing in here but this was I do like this sticker book it's a happy planner sticker book but again can't remember the name of it a jasmine spread because I got these from um oh gosh I don't remember this one was fun and bright um Probably the Live Love Posh Yellow Blooms book. And some headers and checklists from the green one. Didn't do a September currently. September monthly. I loved this spread. This is a Live Love Posh. I think it's a Lux, Lux Living book. Love the colors. Like this, this mint color is like my favorite color. This, as you can see, I did two for this week because I did this and hated it. And so then I did another one, which isn't much better. Um, I don't know what was going on this week. Maybe a block or something. Um, here's another Live Love Posh Luxe Living. I thought this was really pretty. I like how that turned out. And then for the first week of fall, I did some squad girls and this was um, a color story book from Happy Planner that had a lot of um, big size stickers in it and this butterfly theme. And I did an October currently page, but you can see I didn't fill it out. 
October, I did um, a pink spread, um, and this is from Live Love Posh, Lux Living, I think. Pink for breast cancer awareness. These were autumn vibes, and this is, I, I'm pretty sure, because I can tell from this, Amber plans her day. And then these were probably rainbow quotes from Calipa Plan. More Live Love Posh Lux Living. This was so pretty. Um, I love it, but I didn't fill it out, as you can see. I think I was really busy this week or, or just wasn't feeling it for some reason, but a really pretty spread. And then, yeah, didn't fill it out at all this week. I don't remember what was going on, but I must have been having a hard time or something. And then I pretty, I really liked this um, currently page I did for, I guess it's November. And I had seen Michelle from Plan On It do something like this on her channel. So I, I tried to replicate that. It's not as pretty as hers, of course, but, and then I tried to do a perspective drawing here, um, just with things that we're thankful for, or I'm thankful for. Uh, November. Bit of fun. These are from Amber Plans Her Day. Um, more Amber Plans Her Day. This was like autumn vibes probably or fall. Another really cute spread, but again, I didn't finish it. I think I was just getting really overwhelmed and stressed with the holiday season coming up. And so I was finding it hard to keep up on on my planner. Um, I made this election day sticker on my Cricut, but it turned out weird. Um, this I used a color storybook. This says back to work, so I'll probably just, maybe I had some days off. Keats and I are home again. Oh, Keats was sick. My son was sick, yeah. So that was what was going on there. This was my Thanksgiving spread. I used some Archer and Olive washi tape and then checklist to make it look like a table and then put um, some food stickers on here, which I'm pretty sure were from Whimsy Lux, A Year of Planning. Maybe a few from that and then um, more from, I gotta get it out so I can tell you what it is. A lot of them were from Amber Plants Her Day, uh, Fall Collections and Fall Memories. And I thought that was cute. Didn't do a December currently page. Didn't fill out um, my monthly, really. I filled it out by writing in it, but not decorated. My um, grandma died in her sleep December 1st. And so it's just a rough time. And the week leading up to that was really rough. Um, <sighs> yeah, I'm not going to talk about that. I'll get upset. Um, yeah, this was just a, oh, a fall to winter spread. So this week started December and our Thursday on was December. And then this was the, the end of November. So I did fall over here, Christmas over here. And this was from Whimsy Lux, a year of planning. And then I did a big old red and green Christmas theme. Mm. Yeah. And then this was Holly Jolly from Live Love Posh. I did a non-traditional Christmas with these colors, but they're so pretty. And then a very traditional spread this week for Christmas, which was also from Live Love Posh, Holly Jolly. And I think these are from a little um, JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop sticker book I had. Um, so yeah, super busy this week, a lot going on. I didn't fill it out a lot, but it is pretty, pretty decorated. And then I kept my um, last week of the year spread in this, in this book. And um, a lot of these, like I made this on my Cricut, I made this on my Cricut. 
I made these on my Cricut, so a couple of wrong, wrong girls here. I made this one, so I made a lot of these stickers on my Cricut, and then I think um, I used blush in it maybe for some of the, the boxes and maybe the black and white Happy Planner sticker book. Oh, and then I had my spring cleaning checklist back here that I had made earlier in the year, which I probably need to move to my new journal. So that is that. That was my 2022 Big Happy Planner. So thank you for watching. If you want to see more, please subscribe and like, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.